Christmas people of the internet. Hello, it's me again. Um, Mr. Delafield, Mr. Yeti, YouTube name. Um, subscribe, like, comment. Um, anyway, ha ha ha! It's Christmas Eve! It's Christmas Eve! Um, and unfortunately, Christmas Eve means it's the final, final for this year. It might be the final one ever, we might not do this next year. The final pound shop Christmas decoration is going to go up onto this door frame. Um, so, what we'll do is we'll do a quick recap for you, for anyone who, who's missed any of the episodes here. Um, the first decoration went up way back in November, was this spooky, dead-eyed Santa Claus who keeps stirring at people. He's quite scary, but he's got a glittery beard and magnificence. Um, next up we had the glittery reindeer with um, suicidal tendencies, we didn't do that on video, they, they went up uh, unannounced. But we had the glittery reindeer with suicidal tendencies. Um, after that we had um, this anorexic snowman who gets no love, he gets no love, the anorexic snowman. Um, after that we have my personal favourite so far, which is the um, Belen Santa, I think he's my best one. After um, that we then had another bell creature, slanty eyed penguin. Um, then, oh, oh, he's still turning the wrong way. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, true to form, he's, oh, he's wanting to turn the wrong way. Oh, come on, stay still. After that, we had the um, hate crime victim reindeer. He's doing alright now, his he's form's still a bit broken, but he, he's, his head's sorted itself out. His neck's alright now. His neck's alright, everyone. Everyone, he, he sort himself out. Then we had um, the one from last week. It's got a bit of beard fluff attached to it. Was this uh, the slow ranger, the um, rather drunk Christmas furry, the true spirit of Christmas? Um, so that's it so far. A bit of a recap. Um, took a bit of time. I'm a bit exhausted after that. I don't know about you. So bombs up. Merry Christmas. So, yes, without further ado, let's see what the pound shop. Oh, took my hat in a little bit, a red shirt. Let's see what the pound shop has provided for us this final time. Uh, it was a bit scary in pound shop, I think they are running out of supplies for Christmas decorations, spending Christmas Eve and all. So let's see what we've got. Merry Christmas. Look at him! It's another Santa Claus, but look, look at him. Isn't he magnificent? He's like some kind of tentacled, squid-faced Santa Claus. Look at him. It's like, um... It's like if H.P. Lovecraft designed Santa Claus. This is, you know, this is what H.P. Lovecraft would come up with. This would be... He's like... Santa Cthulhu. Something. Santa Cthulhu, insanity claws, call him what you will, um we'll call him a, a very cherished Christmas decoration. So, yes, this is the final one. Look at him. He's not... Uh, look, it's a tartan around his legs. He's got this onion-shaped body. His head, this nose, his eyes. I, I don't know what's all that. I don't know what it's about. Other than, yeah. Santa Cthulhu! Power room! Cthulhu! Oh, I'm going a bit Lesser Junior there. Oh, oh, don't want to cross the streams on my YouTube channel. Here. Oh, oh, oh. Anyway, so let's remove his tag. He's a Christmas decoration. Let's see, what does it say? Warning! This is not a toy! It is for decoration purposes only! Do not give to children to play with! Choking hazard may contain small parts. Keep away from fire! So we've got to keep him away from the fire. What well, a better way to keep him away from fire by putting stick him on the door for him. Um, he doesn't have a dibbly 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 thing tag to pin up, so I'm just going to put a pin straight through him again, like we did with the um, head crime victim reindeer. Um, I've actually run out of pins now. There's some weird things going on in his hat, I'm not even sure what that is. I think it's cut glass or something. Well done, Power Chop. So, um, I've run out of pins, so what we're going to do, we're going to take down the. Um, chocolate coins because quite frankly like um, Ireland and Italy and uh, Greece we only have one euro left anyway so um, a bit depleted don't know how that's happened um, 
<laughs> Christmas isn't it well. Hey, yes, yes, yes. Anyway, we're going to pin him up by his hat. It's quite a long hat. Look how long his hat is. Not as long as mine, but you know, mine's proportionate. This is, it's, 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 it's twice the size he is. Anyway, so we'll put him up on the door frame because that's where he wants to live with his rest of his Santa Claus. Because you know, if you know anything about um, Christmas true story of Christmas, you'll know that um, overweight bearded men feature quite highly in the um, true story of Christmas. So we'll put him in here. And you know what, I started this off saying I didn't want to be a, a Christmas bar humbug anymore. I, I didn't want to have an old Christmas where I'm going, oh, oh I'm miserable, it's Christmas. <laughs> No Christmas, oh, everyone else enjoys it, I don't enjoy it. And you know what? It's worked. It has worked. I, I, I'm loving this Christmas already. <coughs> oh, excuse me, I'm dying here. But, yeah, no, because no, I'm dying, doesn't, yeah, that means I should enjoy Christmas more. So yes, I'm loving this Christmas. This Christmas is brilliant. I'm so excited for Christmas. And I'm, I hope that me making these vlogs has made you eager for Christmas as well. So, um, I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you've enjoyed these Christmas decorations. Like I say, that's, that's it now. That's the Pound Shop Christmas decorations done. Um, they'll be going away soon. Go and um, live in a, a box for a year, as they do. Which I'll miss them, because they've all got their own little personalities now. Especially the little belly in Sansa. She's brilliant. But anyway, that's it. So, Merry Christmas, everybody! And, um... God save the Queen! Or, or whatever you say, Tiny Tim. Tra!